You ready? But the sooner you give your statement, the sooner you... A few you more can... minutes won't make a difference. I could have a quiet word with Abby, please. Yeah, of course. I'll just be over there. Yeah. You know, I used to fight with my old man all the time. I loved him, but sometimes I couldn't stand him. Fathers and daughters, huh? Abby, this is a murder case. I know, but Ben's innocent. Look, forget about Ben for a second. Whatever you tell that lot in there, your dad is going to be in serious trouble, the kind he can't walk away from. Look, I can square it with Phil. It'll be fine if you want to change your mind. You've got to be 100% sure. I am. Um... I don't have to spell it out to you two. I prefer my clients with a pulse. You know your nan. She didn't mean any harm. I think she was just trying to put in a good word. Oh, well, telling him I'd rather work with stiffs. It's not her fault Dean got the wrong end of the stick. You're breaking her heart, Paul. Me? Pot kettle. There's only one woman in my life. I haven't even seen Claudette in months. Come home, will you? Come. I'm going down the Albert for a drink with some of my mates from Blades. We're celebrating. Lola's got a new job, haven't you heard? Paul! I don't know. They came to the flat, the police. What did they want? I told you, didn't I? <sighs> I've got to go now. Oh, come on. You can't go. It's all right. No, you can't come with me. You are coming back, though, right? <sighs> Safe fair. Give me half hour. Well, I thought... I'm getting Lexi's stuff. We're coming with you. Oh, OK, OK, OK. Well, meet me at the tube in half hour. Look, look. What? <sighs> right. 